Yo, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Y'all see I got a step deck. Couldn't hold on to the RGN. Um, the reason why is I had to do a load from... Uh, I do a load from Oklahoma City to Minneapolis, Minnesota. And that load required a, a flatbed. The reason why I took that load is because I had to go take a test at headquarters. And that test allowed me to be a if I pass the test, it allowed me to be a class two driver. Me and I can haul loads up to 14 feet high and up to 14 feet wide. I took that test on Monday and I passed it. And then, uh, I picked up another load Monday night of uh, two generators and took that to an Air Force base in uh, is, is it O Foot O F F U T T Nebraska, right outside of uh, Omaha, and now I am picking up. some uh, machinery here. I already know where my trailer at, so y'all gonna <coughs> y'all gonna be with me and everything. I already moved my dunnage over. So I gotta secure that. And then we'll be taking off heading to Texas. Oh boy. All right, clean my windshield. and 53 minutes left on my clock for the day so I think I'm gonna do this and run an hour towards the road I don't know if y'all see that chain on the ground but that's that's my trailer I'm picking up some uh, round hay bellers four of them and I got four stops like I said I'm going to Texas New tires put on the truck. On the truck, two new tires.
Okay, we're putting it in chains. Uh-oh, come on, stand up some more right now. Oh, come on. Oh, my bun is on this side over here. So we got this here hook with this wire to help us pull it through, pull our chain through.
Why is that it? Easier to chain down than this. Uh, I don't know. That's I said, I don't know. Where are you dealing with? J hooks. Huh? J hooks. You can chain, use these to chain stuff down too. How are you? We don't have those. I've never seen it before, so or yeah. for that matter. Yeah, they're just like chaining in it's just like using these here. But those allow you to have a lot more uh chain down points. Yeah, you ain't got them. You ain't got these slot, these slots in there. Not enough posts and everything else, so. Huh? Not enough posts and everything else, so. No. Nah. Cause we also got the D-rings that slide down here too. So we got those as tie down points and everything, so. Yeah. We got a lot of options. But just if we use them. Well, I think they went with the cheapest thing they could lay their hands on. <laughs> that sounds like any truck, any company. A lot of companies do that. What's that? I say a lot of companies do that. Go with the cheapest thing they can find and then at that point it's like, yeah, it is what it is. But so this to me looks a whole lot better than those. Well, I, I like these spools because they're circular, which makes it, it's not any hard oh, corners. really? Yeah, these are square corners, so you can bend these and break these easily. Those are welded all the way around. These are only welded on the top oh. and on the bottom. They're not welded all the way around, see that? Yeah, but I don't have enough of them. I don't, no, you should have the same. You, you got the same amount I got, cause we got two, we got two, and then a pocket, you got two in the pocket. So if this is a 53 foot, you should have the same amount I got. The only difference is 
I still got something next to my tires. You, I mean, you got something next to your tires too. Yeah. Except for right here, I don't have nothing right here cause my axles are sliding. I got sliding axles. Well, this one does, we got some that do have sliding axles on them, but not all of them are mm -hmm. like, like sliding axles. Yeah. I mean, it's not a bad gig. I, I like it. It's just one of those like, I'd rather have an RGN anyways. Yeah. Like no, this one here, this one broke. You got and everything. This one here broke, this thick pocket right here broke. You see that oh, wheel? shh. All the way down to the bottom. That, that's bad. That doesn't surprise me, but that's And bad. technically speaking, since that broke, I ain't supposed to use nothing within two feet of that broke, that broken yeah. wheel. So I'm gonna have to change this. See, I gotta change that, right? I either can use this D-ring down here and pull to the D-ring, or I can use those those J-hooks, put them right here, and then just pull to the J-hook. So now I st now I got, or well, put it right here, I got more tie down points now. Well, there's the difference. Too hard at oh, <laughs> I ain't. I'm about done for the day, anyways. Yeah. I started yeah, in. Um, I think I'm supposed to be off to Michigan with this load. Oh, I'm going down to Texas. Ah, well, have a good one. Yes, sir. You too. Stack them on top of each other, run a four inch strap. Like if you used to got, got, uh, take this and stack another on top of it and do the same thing on the other side. That way you got at least four boxes, run a four inch strap across that one and then run another four inch strap across. That one tied down to the pallet. So this one in the middle is tied down to the pallet. So take those two and put them on top of these and throw a four inch across the top right there and another one right here. Cause that one is secured by uh, that that green strap to the pallet, the one in the middle up under this one, the one up under that one right there. Oh. Put that one on top. Then put another one. Put the other one over there. No, that one's that one tied down. You see it? Which one? This one. That one. Oh, this one. Yeah. I have so many boxes. I will push it on the other side of that one. I'm sorry, what? Taking it, throw it on the other side. Throw it on the other side? Yeah. Just flip it over. Yeah, right there. And now I throw a four inch strap across that to hold that down. All right. And then throw another four inch strap across this one right here by yeah. itself.
bed is a little warm out here, but I ain't as bad as where I'm going. Hey, hey, I wanna say hey. Thank you, Lord. Oh, you died for me. It could have been me. Outdoors. No fool. No fool. Oh, just not remember.
forks and then uh, just secure it. Just do it uh, do one chain lean this way, one chain lean that way. Okay, I got these over here. Yeah, so run the chain through the tube. Run the chain through the tube. Bring it out to say like right up here, aim right here, and do the other one. You ain't got no J hooks? Uh, no yeah. J hooks? Yeah. I, the hooks, no, the hooks that, that is the machine. Main. Right, I got them, but on this one right here, there's really no way. chains through the fork tubes, anchor them here, and then anchor them down there, one ratchet, tighten them down, and that's it. Yeah, that'll work too. Yeah. Because they think there's no, I got two there's no key like hooks got, or any. I got the hooks, I mean, I got the the J hook for it, yeah. the one that go inside of it and turn. Right, right. Yeah. But this ain't got, this ain't for that, this ain't, I'm just Is saying. Is that a camera? Yeah. What you do? Record right. your load? Yeah, I got it. I got it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I need one of them, man. I'm about to do that. That's tight. Uh, I want to do my work. The only other way I see it, like yeah. he said, is um, how you going to run, if you going to run the chain through all the way through that all way? way.